Welcome back, everyone. It is my Saturday. It is your Sunday, right? Isn't that, co- is isn't this, that so is weird? This... I'm, I'm a full day ahead of you. I still can't like get around that. Like a full day. I know, me either. And I'm always thinking, okay, Raj is 16 hours ahead. What is that? It's like so confusing. You must- I'm living I mean, in the been future. There for, seriously, you are. You've been there for a whole week now, right? Yeah, here for a full week. And now I'm finally just getting used to it. I'm all acclimated, ready to roll. Yeah. Oh, you're used to it. What is that? Like you're waking up on time and you're like, okay, this is it. This is my new schedule. Waking up on time. And look at this, Savvy. I have money now. Oh. I have currency. This is a thousand is, yen. Isn't that beautiful? That is e- that's beautiful. What does that equal to? It's about a thousand. Uh, a thousand yen. It's about a hundred yen to a dollar. So this is about 10 bucks, 10 US dollars. Okay. That's beautiful. Which is cool. That looks really crisp too. That's a yeah, crisp, crisp bill. Crisp. I mean, everything here is just like perfect, right? So it doesn't surprise me that the money is even clean, you know? That's beautiful. Oh, that, yeah, since we're talking about the cleanliness, right? So Liz and Raj, I mean, there's a lot going on. Second day of, well, I guess it's the first official day of the Olympics. No, it's the second for you. Yeah, (laughs) you're going to get all confused trying to do that. (laughs) (laughs) You you need a cocktail. (laughs) I know, I know, after all of this. But I know that you've been talking to Nigel Houston. He's a local um, athlete. He, you know, he does skateboarding. Skateboarding made its debut um, for us today, for you yesterday. How was that? I know you, you did a story on him. How was that? Oh, Nigel's a rock star. You know, I didn't know much about him, honestly, until until just recently. And uh, grew up in Davis. Um, his dad actually bought a skate park for him, kind of a, a rundown skate park. Uh, near the sac- near the Davis area, and they were just skating as kids since he was five years old. You know, we talk about like Tiger Woods or Andre Agassi or even Venus Williams of kind of like child prodigies. Nija Houston is that guy for skateboarding. Wow. And, and Abby, wow. he has 4.7 4. million Instagram followers. I lot. know, he's famous. He's a famous <laughs> dude. And he's like 26, right? Yeah, he's 26. Yeah. I mean, he's a multimillionaire. And, you know, now with his Olympics exposure, it's going it, to, in theory, his income and his exposure is probably going to double, if not triple, because now, like, the general population knows about it. I didn't know about him until the Olympics. Yeah, and this guy is is a rock star for sure. So you got to talk to him. Is he really chill? He's chill. He's kind of, I think he's kind of gotten some training, though, because just oh. a few months ago, he was more bad boy. Yeah, I don't care. I'm here, you know, dropping and some now he's more settled. And, stuff. and now he's corporate, <laughs> Abby. He went big time. Now he's like, you know, I'm here. I'm here for Team USA. I really like it. Of course, he's got 90 percent tattoos yeah, yeah. on his body, um, uh-huh. but he, he looks the part. He's hip. I mean, he, he's legit. He's not a poser. But now I think he's a little more polished. I think his corporate sponsors have talked to him just a bit, which is all good. It's part of growing up. He definitely has a PR rep now for sure. That hey, have you heard? So have awesome. you heard about? Have you heard about this typhoon that's coming our way? I was way about to ask you, just... Raj. You're chill. You're chilling, oh. and I'm like, oh my gosh, there's going to be a storm out there. Is it? I mean, what are the rumors? What's happening? I know surfing well, starts today for you guys out there on Sunday. That could be of influence, right? Well, it's already impacted the games. Rob Maeda, our meteorologist, uh, you know, back in the Bay Area. Um, kind of giving me all the updates. He says Tuesday Tokyo time, Tuesday afternoon Tokyo time. So it's Monday for you guys. Um, it's rolling through. It's going to be uh, mm-hmm. some wind. It's going to be a lot of rain. Not damaging where it's going to damage buildings, you know, cause a catastrophe here. However, uh, the Olympics have already uh, rescheduled some events. So rowing was supposed to happen Tuesday. Instead, it's going to happen Sunday and Monday. So they're they're wow. moving things around. Um, Rob was, was saying that we should watch the um, the pollution level in the water that could be impacted because of all the rain yeah. with the spill off the runoff. So it's oh. yeah, pandemic typhoon. We got, we got it all here, Abby. We got it all. <laughs> Literally every single thing on the list. Wow. But the, the way that the committee is sort of just adapting so quickly and being like, okay, we're going to move this around. And the athletes, I mean, the athletes being like, okay, I was going to, you know, do it on Tuesday, but now it's two days ahead. That must impact them too. Uh, that is. Yeah. Awesome. And, but you know what? This you is, it's fine. I think it's one of those things. It's weather related. So I think everyone had this. It's This is the heart of the season here. It's like being in Miami right now in September, right? You just know it's coming. So everyone knew it was a possibility. So they're just they're just adapting. They're just adapting. Hey, you know what else I posted, by the way, today? Or yesterday, what did you post? I haven't seen. Oh, my gosh. Uh, the women in terms of the breakdown. 
So you go back just to the Athens Olympics or the Beijing Olympics and the to, uh, the Rio Olympics, and the women were like 20%, 30%, 40%. Now it's 47% women on, on the Olympic team. It's almost split. That's awesome, right? <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Those are the stats that yes, bless my heart. Cool. Oh my gosh, that is fantastic. I mean, it's it, uh, women have a long way to go, um, but it's great to hear these stats. I mean, that is fantastic. Forty-seven uh, percent, almost, almost there, almost half. But we're, hey, we're that, there. that's half. That's halfway <laughs> in my book. That's you know that that's right there. So it's really cool. So lastly, here, Wash, what do you have planned for the rest of today? So we are, guess where I'm going, a few hours from now, uh, actually not a few, probably like nine hours from now, Team USA basketball against France. So That's I'll be gonna chatting. Be exciting. It's going to be cool. I'll be chatting with uh, Draymond Green, Steve Kerr, Damian Lillard from Oakland, wow. KD, Kevin mm -hmm. Durant. So we'll see how they uh, they do. They should be fine, but you know, you never know. Um, so that that's that's my big event um, that later on today. So Sunday night for me. I don't know what the heck it is for you. Something for us. <laughs> Something Saturday <laughs> Something for in you. the weekend. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll be looking out for everything you post on social media at Raj Mathai. Raj, always so fun talking to you. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Okay. Happy weekend, Abby. Take care. Bye-bye. Happy weekend.